Sometimes the medical professionals do make mistakes. A lot of people put a lot of stock in their healthcare, and as they should. In the medical malpractice arena in the state of Florida, you have a very finite window of time to bring a claim. It's two years from when you knew or should have known of the actual commission of the malpractice. Most people don't know when that happens. Some attorneys don't even know when that happens. And yes, absolutely, you want to deal with an attorney who essentially has a subspecialty in medicine. And when you deal with somebody who works in this arena often, you deal with so many different experts, you actually do acquire a, a set of medical knowledge. I've had many physicians tell me that you know, you know as much medicine in this area as we do you know and the nice thing is as the attorney my job is to at least recognize the problem I'm not suggesting in any way shape or form that I can treat the problem but at least I can figure it out get to the people that know better as to what should have been done and orchestrate this team to get the justice and relief that the patient requires Regrettably, in the, the nursing home context, there are some really uh, poor providers, and these are, are situations where you have a patient who is, or a resident, as we call them, who is compromised, and that's why they're being entrusted to the care of these facilities. And the facilities don't take the proper time to recognize what these individuals need, don't take the time to have them assessed properly, don't take the time to ensure that their fall risks are taken care of, and it exposes the resident to a lot of dangers and hazards which is the reason why they're being put in that facility in the first place. These individuals are frail and their rights are, are no less uh, important than someone who's not in these facilities. In fact, I would say you probably have more of a responsibility to them because they need somebody to fight for them. Some of them have Alzheimer's, some of them have dementia. They don't have the ability to communicate the way we need to 